So uh, this is just a quick video to uh, show the advantages of a Pluto which happens to be revision C. So the first thing to do check the Pluto is working. Next thing to do is to remove these screws and of course unplug it. Once you've removed these screws you can uh, lift the top off And uh, you can see here, it has these extra pit, uh, little sockets. The ones here are for the clock, the oscillator, input and output. So you can put an external clock in or take a clock out. So up here, you've got the transmit and receive but down here you have an extra transmit and receive input now to use these you look on a, a well-known auction site and you buy these things which are uh, plugs that plug into here and they're the same as those at the end so I uh, can't remember what they're called but I'll put a note of it if I can. Um, the next thing to do is to take this little bracket out and to do that you have to undo these for a start. and undo the four screws so uh, the, these four screws here are one, two, three, four so uh, I'll have to put the camera down when I do that magnetic screwdriver right now just before I go any further you're going to do some drilling this is why I'm taking all the bits but these oops these uh, are going to be into here. Now, when you put them in here, you can't put them in line with those because the uh, you can see they'd uh, go straight into the uh, printed circuit board. So, when you drill in there, you have to put the hole up here more, up here. So uh, you can lift this up, lift that out, and use this to drill the holes now for these up here somewhere. And make sure the hole's the right size. So when you uh, have drilled them, plug the uh, bits in, you'll get something that looks a bit like this. It's probably all out of focus, but uh, I tried. <laughs> So uh, there they are, There's with the extra bits in. Now, what we've got to do now is put these back on there like that. Thank you. 
screw the four screws back in. Magnetic screwdriver. I don't think they need to be over tightened. Now, all you do then is Plug these into those. You might have to twist these round so that it bends easier, I found. But um, they sort of go in with a click of sorts. And there you have it uh, a Pluto with uh, two transmitters and two receivers um, you can also put some on here as I said uh, for uh, external clock and uh, things so um, that's it um, it's just a matter of getting the uh, firmware and software to um, to work with it all so uh, when you bought these off uh, certain eBay or something uh, you get five in a packet so what do you do with the other ones well you've used two to extend the uh, the uh, Pluto to give two transmissions and two reception reception places so you can use the third um, a third one to put an external clock in So uh, it comes like that, and uh, and you want to uh, refer to this website. Uh, for uh, the details, that's where I got the inspiration from.